Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to our playthrough of Nexomon Extinction. Now, I did do a little bit of grinding off screen because apparently uh, I was too under leveled. So <laughs> let's jump in. Uh, if you guys want to see what I got going on here, uh, we got Reptomotor up to 65. Voltake and Voltake's a little, uh, still a little uh, under leveled, but we got Domigator. Uh, we caught one, uh, a pretty high leveled one at that. Uh, Barbarico is leveled up and we caught a legendary Titan. Um, so yeah, I, I, I did some stuff off screen, you see, I, I, I can do it, I just, I can't upload a, a video every day if I do, <laughs> that's why the Wii, we didn't have a Let's Play come out yesterday, <laughs> but I did do some stuff, so let's, uh, let's do it up. Can we use our authority to, to delete that from our record? That is such an outrageous thing to ask, Coco, but yes, I'm on it. Hello, Grandmaster Ed. Okay. How do we rent out the ship again? Just grab all this stuff real quick. Thanks, dude. Okay, we gotta go to the orphanage. See, I remembered. Hey, what's going on in here? There are reports of renegade sightings near this building. Now get out of here before I... Th that's a Grand Master badge. I'm so sorry, Ed. News of your promotion has barely surfaced. You, you want us to leave this place, but what about the renegade... You fools, they are no match for Grand Master Ed. Y you're right, of course. We're leaving this to you, sir. Ooh, I like my authority. I can't believe that worked. We should find more ways to abuse this authority later. Anyways, we should meet with the renegades now. Ed, I've heard of your promotion. Congratulations. Too bad there might not be a guild anymore soon, huh? That's not funny. <laughs> this is it, yes. Now that you're a Grandmaster, we can use your airship to drag battles outside of the city. Your tyrants will then ambush him, and you'll be indisputably the king of Nexomon. With your permission, Ed, I shall have my minions prepare the airship right away. Don't worry, Ed, we've got your back. It's like I never tried to take you hostage, haha. <laughs> oh my, did you try to take him hostage as well? How grand. So unoriginal. I took his friend hostage instead. Long live Ed, Emperor of Animals or whatever. I hate every single one of you. Ed, there's one more thing you need to do. You must go and speak with Vados. Visit him atop the tower. Whoa, are you insane? Why should we go there alone? We can't hit Vados with an airship in plain daylight. Come on. We need you to distract him. As Grand Master, you're the only one with access to the upper levels of the tower. Only then will we have a chance to take him away from the city. The airship will take Vados to a faraway island. The tyrants are already waiting for them for the ambush. That remains... That remains... Uh, sorry, all that remains is for you to distract them. What happens will shape the future of our world. He must ride as, as a true king of monsters. Tell me how it is. I still want to know who my daddy is. Give me my daddy. I love my new outfit. Now we go here. Oh yeah, I forgot you are here, buddy. That door leads up to the upper levels of the tower. Battles is definitely further ahead. If you manage to defeat him, he'll surely be acknowledged as the king of monsters, Ed. Don't make eye contact with anyone in this room, Ed. Oh, they all call me Grandmaster. I love it. Just no way. You became a Grandmaster? You? Ugh, fine. I guess it's your name that will go down in history books, mate. Eh, shut up.
Ed, my king. We tried to clear the path for you, but one of their tamers is just way too strong. You must tread lightly, sir. Should we give Thick Boy a try? I didn't set up his moves. Oh well. Should we set up his moves first? Let's set up his moves first. Just uh, go out real quick and give him a good old uh, move swap. Yeah, I just caught him just before, uh, n not too long before recording, so I did forget to set up his moves. Uh, I don't want him to have crappy moves, but then again, I did spend most of my money, so we'll see what I can even buy. What else is new? You guys, uh, you guys subscribed for this. <laughs> okay, uh, let's do it, buddy. I can't afford anything. Let's see, okay, so deals great uh, physical damage with high accuracy. Okay, we'll keep that. Has a 40% chance, chance to instantly faint your opponent if they're at least 15 levers, levels lower. That's kind of cool, but I doubt I'm 15 levels higher than anything. Removes all status ailments. I think that's got pretty good. Next three ghost type skills have 100% accuracy. So this could be good in conjunction with this, but problem is um, I'm not 15 levels higher than anything. What does he, uh, what else does he know? So let's just say I get rid of uh, Constrict just because it's not useful right now. Um, let's see what else he's got. Eternal dark, uh, Darkness would be nice. Removes all status conditions, stamina surge. Uh, reduces opponent's accuracy by 30% for three turns. Recover. 35% uh, chance to increase paralyze. Do you have any like whittling damage though? Just deals ghost type damage, uh, ghost type damage. Ghost type damage, nothing crazy. Reduces his opponent's accuracy. Man, he doesn't have any, like, really good attacks. Um. Okay, you know what? We'll just give him an attack that just deals ghost type damage since uh, he doesn't have. I was hoping he'd have like a like an attack that either like poisons you, or or does something that'll cause whittling damage that can go along with his heals. Uh, that would be really helpful. Uh, but oh well. Remember, you guys remember how I told you not to spend your mining shards on anything? Yeah. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna do that. So do as I say, not as I do. Now uh, I have only two of these. I have a bunch of these. I just need, I just need, uh, 75 bucks. Yeah, do as I say, not as I do. Okay, let's teach him, uh, one of those ghost type attacks just so we have something. So we can do some level of damage. 60 looks like his highest base power attack. Oh, 100. And it always hits. So why would I use this? Why would I use the 60 one then? What does this give me? A little more speed? Not worth. Okay, arcane magic. That other attack he has is really useful, but like I said, just not for where I am right now. Anyways, let's go, uh, let's go not get wrecked. After this let's play is over, uh, we're gonna shift back over to Monster Sanctuary, but I might run two games at the same time. Oh god, he's back. Dun dun dun. There he is, sir. You're right, Ed is behind this mess. Leave us alone, guards. Tell me something, King of Monsters. You grew up in a human orphanage, didn't you? What was it like? He's kind of dirty and... I'm talking to Ed. That place was once my home as well. Because of the tyrants. Because of your disgusting kind. How dare you, Ed. How dare you live amongst my brothers and sisters, Ed. I don't even care about Amelia's stupid pet. This has never been about, about Vados, nay. I became a tamer for one and only one reason. All the terror and all the pain that your kind has brought me. I shall return it to you. You will not harm our king. 
We are the sword of Ed, oh god. We have come to ensure his victory. <laughs> Attack! <laughs> we don't know these people. Now, come, Ed. Your time is up. All right, let's do it. Let's go with uh, Broken Starter first. If you guys saw that that starter video I made, you you know that uh, he's a little uh, he's a little broken. Just a just a tad. I'm glad I found a Domigator in the wild. That was a high level. That was a uh, a very nice catch. I just sort of found it while I was just doing whatever. Uh, because the, the shark we were using was also kind of falling off. I don't know why he's ice assaults. Even if he gets frozen, it's not gonna, it's not gonna last. Uh, the shark was kind of falling off. I mean, th this domigator is not the most powerful thing in the world either, but it's, it's doing a, it's doing a better job. I mean, damn, our Domigator was so underleveled at one point that it was just getting one-shotted. Or two-shotted or whatever. Good times. Alright, that one's dead. Alright, let's go with our Thick Boy. Well, now he switches to the Water type. See, we're not super over-leveled, because I, I didn't want to make myself too over-leveled. Like, if I, if I was just completely over- like, what's the point in one-shotting everything in the game, right? I did want to have it so it was, still was a little bit, like, like a bit, like, you know, not ridiculous. So, um, oh, he actually went for- oh, yeah, he's that. So, um, I'm not too over- like, I'm not crazy over-leveled. I'm actually, like, probably leveled how you're supposed to be. Like some of my guys are under leveled, but they're they're level 62, so I don't think I'm that under leveled. Like I'm I'm on par with all their guys, so I think that's fine. I I, I don't want to grind a level 70 and just and just like dominate, right? It's not that's no fun. Stop switching to your freaking water type, you jerk. This guy's trying to get thick. Good, Voltake did his job as a free switch to Repto Motor. The thickest of boys. Well, you're not gonna survive that. No point in switching. Okay, well, I'm not gonna be able to handle you. Let's go with Titan. Let's see what you got, dude. I guess I don't really need this attack right now either. <laughs> okay, Arcane Magic. Yeah, it's not very good for a legendary, bud. This one's more of a defensive one anyway, but... I want him to get some XP. Let's switch back to Tracer. I did get healing items, if anyone was wondering. I got a bunch, actually. That's why I'm kind of broke. Electrode. EMP. Nice. Uh, okay. Heal. Could you use some stamina, please? Thank you. Okay. Drain. I'll drain him again. Then we'll go for the heal. Oh, you missed. Even better. Alright, now that you're, like, out of stamina, we'll, uh, heal again. Drain. 
See, this is how, again, this is why he's so broken. I could spam drain if I really wanted to. Like, I'm not going to bore you guys by doing that. But if we were talking about 100% strategy right now, I could spam drain to get to full just to ensure that if I don't one-shot him, I'll two-shot him and I'll still have enough stamina. Or, or I can do it so that I have enough stamina for the next battle, right? Like, I could just be like, oh, I'm just going to drain up to 186 so I have enough stamina until, uh, for, you know, for, for the next battle I get into. But... I don't want to bore you guys with me just spamming the A button for like eight minutes. So we're just going to finish it off. Oh yeah, bud. Level 66, level 60. Fire will boost fire type skills by 15%. Can be stacked up to five times. That's a good move because he's bulky. Hmm. I could replace it with the attack boosting move. I don't feel like I need to have two boosts. But then again, it's like raising attack by 25% is probably better than raising just fire, just fire type. Hmm. But does the raging focus stack? This one specifically says it stacks and the raging focus doesn't. So, you know, what? L l let's give it a shot. Let's let's try it out. Barbarico is not exactly uh, an ace of the team anymore, so I'm not too worried. <laughs> so be it, Ed. Did you come to meet Vados? Go on then. The total helplessness that you will feel against him. The sheer dread that you will experience under his gaze. Yes, you will finally understand what it feels like to be a mere human. Says the guy who punched a dragon in the face. See, we stocked up. We stocked up. Oh, I didn't mean to do that, but okay. He's got to check the sides. EXP boost. Ghost whistle. Kind of random, but I'm, I'm, I, I, I'm down with it. Hello, Ed. Atlas. It's the ghost from back then. I've come to thank you, Ed. You are about to set things right. The things that I ruined when I defeated Omnicron centuries ago. Uh, I knew what I had done. To save my present, I chose to destroy your future, Ed. <sighs> in the grand scheme of things... Uh, in the grand... Sorry, in the grand scheme of things, was Omnicron's downfall truly for the good of our world? Why are you telling us this? Because you are no different than me, Ed. You are following my very own footsteps right now. You are about to destroy Vados, are you not? He is he is the imminent threat, just like Omnicron was a millennia ago. Heed my words, friend. What you are about to do will forever change the course of humanity. You will become the king of monsters and rule for an eternity to come. But for better or for worse. Do we have a choice? Vados will hunt us down sooner or later. Of course we have to fight him. I like that they put him there. I've been expecting you for a long time, Ed. Quite the honor to meet the King of Monsters himself. Ed, he knows your identity. Yes, I know exactly who and what you are, child of Nara. I can see through your clever human gaze. I can see the vile and unsightly corruption that lies underneath your skin. Corruption? You're the aberration here. You're not even an actual Nexomon, jerk. It's pretty legit. I like this art. Mm. Yes, indeed. For better or for worse, I am not a true Nexomon. 
The Nexomon are a humiliating disease. They devastated our dearest planet with their barbaric war. The Nexomon are a wicked curse. The poor humans cower in fear behind tall walls and false hopes. The Nexomon are a vicious scourge. They are the culmination of everything that is wrong in our lives. Ed, and you, Ed, are the despicable king of such scum. Oh man, I like this guy. We should root for him. Listen to me and listen well, Ed. I was created to protect mankind at all costs and protect it I will by eradicating the vulgar blight known as Nexomon. Your very existence, I cannot allow it. Disappear with a smile knowing that this world is set towards a brighter tomorrow. Be gone. <laughs> the cat has drool. What, what the heck happened here? We heard a huge explosion just now. Hey, Ed, wake up. D did Vados attack Ed? But why? This can't be. Goodness, is, is this lad okay? I wonder what Ed did to upset Vados so much. Stay away from him, Tamers of the Guild. Nobody cares about the cat. Is it... <laughs> Ed is far more dangerous than you think. Explain yourself, Emil. Yeah, this ain't right. No, I don't think that you want to hear. You just attacked one of your tamers. Fine. Ed is a tyrant in disguise. That's all there is to it, really. T tyrant? Ed a tyrant? Is this a joke? Can Nexomon disguise themselves as humans? No, that's not possible. Whenever a dragon attacks attacked humans, Ed was in the crowd. The dragon outbreak from 15 years ago, right? Was when Ed was born. And now, Vados himself has acknowledged Ed as a tyrant. Hidden in plain sight, is this foul monster deceived us all. So please, step aside. Let Vados end this for once and for all. N no. I, 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 don't, I don't think so. Huh? Of all people, I didn't think that you'd... Shut up. You'll regret this, Ross. Get lost. <laughs> he got wrecked. It's Edward. That's quite enough, all of you. It's Edward! Tamers of the Guild, open your eyes. The very thing that you have sworn to destroy lies right under your feet. There is a dangerous tyrant amongst us. He has deceived us since the day he was born a traitor. Y you want us to hand over Ed? What are you doing for the sake? What are you doing is for the sake of our people. Nothing else matters. M man, we can't do that. that. That's our friend. No, it's just a Nexomon. Nexomon are a plague. They are a spawn of the evil king Omnicron and are the reason we live in this dying world. Born, sorry, but with Vados we can defeat those vile creatures. Heed my words and come to your senses. You shall abandon the tyrant Ed, or you will perish with him. Are you sure about this plan? Perhaps Ed will come to trust humans, but no human in their right mind would ever trust a tyrant. The day will surely come when mankind turns against Ed. So tell me, Dina, who will stand up in your son's darkest hour? Aw, shit. Love the art of this game, man. Hmm. Amelie, you go with Vados. I will hold the line against the traitors. Oh, I've been waiting to fight this guy. It's a battle of the Eds, bro. I cannot believe any of this. How cruel a fate. Fall now, King Ed. But fall knowing that I will despise every second of this. Let's go, buddy. Let's see what you're running. Oh, you got the Domigator? You gonna, you, gonna, you gonna hit me with that water type attack, bro? Is that all you got? You water type? Come on, bro. Failed. Good, you're a failure. You're a failure, Edward. That's right. Who do you think you are, Edward Cullen? Coming in here like that? Let's go. Ooh, you smacking hard, eh? OK, 
Okay, fire claw for the burn. I got stunned. Oh, of course. Okay, we just got the, we just gotta get the burn. Come on. Nothing. Okay, fire on fire. Okay, well we'll save that. Let's go tracer. Come on, bro. What you got? I'm actually genuinely surprised I didn't just destroy him. Huh. Let's uh, go with the Matt Ultra Potion. I was at low health when I started this venture, so. Get Rock Knight. Get out. Ghost Boy. Let's go with Water Boy. Oh, your sus attack missed, bro. Let's try to get a freeze going. Come on, freeze. Switch to the grass type. I actually have a pretty decent weakness to grass. Or plant, rather. I'm gonna use this legendary to just heal my regular Nexomon. Bring out the sore. Sore boys got this. He's spitting some heavy damage though. I'm not even worried about like a a, a freaking uh, what do you call it? A psychic type. You want to play the not very effective game? I'll do it. Just enough stamina to kill you. Oh, I guess not. Okay. You ain't got enough stamina to do nothing now. Hmm, let me use my ghost type. We got me hexed. Alright, he dead. Who you got next? Who you gonna use next, buddy? Psychic boy? Go with electric boy. Electric storm? Looking for the, uh, the para-hacks, but, uh... Doesn't look like the para-hacks are looking for me. Nope. All right, Repto, dude. Got him. Oh, you have an electric type left. How cute. Oh, what's that? I'm broken? What? What, Repto motor's broken what? Say what, I'm broken? What? Oh. Oh, I didn't realize uh, I was broken. I didn't realize I was broken. Let's keep going. How you like your stamina, bro? You like losing all your stamina and not even taking out half my health? I guess just over half my health? Come on, dude. What you got? Oh, I got puzzled. Okay, I have to drain that. <laughs> okay, hopefully I don't get puzzled again. Okay, puzzled has gone. You don't even have enough stamina to attack, bro. Oh, I'm tired. Better rest. Oh, thanks for your stamina, man. Appreciate it. Use it to heal again. Thank you. Can you hit me with a little attack? Oh, that did so much damage. Oh my gosh. Oh, you couldn't attack? That sucks. Yeah, it's literally the path to victory. Just drain... Attack. Drain. Attack. Heal. 
drain attack. Let's heal. <laughs> oh my god. Drain. <laughs> I don't know, man. I think, like, if PvP becomes a thing, this definitely needs to get nerfed. Like, this is insane. <laughs> okay, we can go for the MP. Sick of waiting. Just drain a little bit, you know, here and there. You know, take it off the top. Take it off the top, bud. Get out of here. You make me sick. Oh, yeah. Look at all those level ups. Huh. Mm. I'm taking your cell phone. Shouldn't we be heading towards Vados? The guild was built to serve both humans and Nexomon. It's clear that they strayed from their path long ago. What about you guys? Heck yeah. No more secrets from now on, Ed. Whatever lies ahead, we will confront it as one. Who cares if Palad is a Nexomon? That guy saved us back then. I'm repaying this debt. Let's roll. That's right, Chad. You know what's good for you. Lead the way, Ed. We've got your back. Okay, let me stop to heal real quick. Whoa. whoa. So this is what Vados looks like up close. Ed, you wretched king of monsters. I see that you have led these poor tamers astray. How deplorable, how cowardly. I thought you were better than this. But your efforts are for naught, Ed. The tamers of the guild support my existence. The citizens of Parham encourage my mission. The children of this world rely upon my triumph. But you, what do you have, Ed? A ragtag team of traitors? A gang of useless tyrants? A feeble handful of Nexomon slaves? Is that all you have, Ed? Is that how your final stand shall be? We have an airship. Huh? What did you say, an airship? <laughs> That's messed up. <laughs> the achievement name. What the heck was that? What did you guys do? An airship? You, you guys plan to hit battles with an airship? Yes. That is messed up. Perhaps. D does that mean we just finished the game? Yep, that was everything. Battles has been defeated. Let the credits roll. Stop. Stop, stop, stop. Quit the credits, morons. <laughs> they went they went for that a uh, little longer than I expected. <laughs> Tisk! What is wrong with you guys? This isn't over yet, you buffoons. What the? The plan went, was just to distract them, wasn't it? The airship will drag them far away so the tyrants can defeat him. Battles is gonna wreck the airship before it gets there, fool. You gotta weaken him first, the ambush won't be successful. Now hold on tight, all right? I'll warp all of you onto the airship. What, are you insane? I don't want to be in the same airship as Vados. Don't do this. Too bad. <laughs> Teleporting magic OP.
Everybody needs full health. All right. Oh, Ed. This is it, isn't it? The end game, as they call it. The path ahead is full of hardships. Perhaps this is just a bad dream. Perhaps you can wake up for it, from it. You wish to return to the capital city? This will reset your progress to before defeating Edward. Now stay here. Battles must be upstairs. You have to weaken him so that the other tyrants can beat him once we arrive on the ambush site. We are so close. All right, guys. Well, we're gonna we're gonna see how this goes. Uh, if I get destroyed, I'll make a cut, and you guys will. Uh, see me here again so hopefully that doesn't happen <laughs> oh yeah Get all my minions you will go to the deck of the airship now ye Why's Coco up there? Observe, Ed. To destroy me, you've doomed all your friends. How many... Where's the psychic girl at, though? Like, really? How many ought to suffer until your wickedness is quenched? Oh, vile king of monsters, on this day I swear to you, this burning airship under our feet shall be your tomb. Proto Vados. I'm scared. I'm scared to see how much damage he does. <laughs> 130? Oh, he switches types. Okay. Get at me, bro. Yeah, so when I made my review of the game, I was right before this fight, and I lost my save file. So, yeah, that's why in my review I didn't really talk about the post-game, I just talked about the journey leading up to it. That's why. Um, so, I'm finally in a spot where I'm not doing something I had already done before. So now if I, if I don't remember something, it's not because I didn't remember, it's because I haven't done it. This is exciting. Granted, it took me a lot less time to get to where I was. Um, like, I'm 35 hours in on this file. I was only, like, 20-something when I got here. Because, again, I, I didn't I didn't do all the side stuff I'm doing now. I didn't spend time looking for uh, vaults or vault keys off screen. Like, stuff like that. I just did the main story. So, I'm very excited to uh, finally be, like, where I was. Oh, wind. Do you change into a wind type? I'm fine with that. Fireclaw. Come on, Babarco. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I didn't realize he changed types. Ah, I'll deal with the electric. Give him a little burn. Okay, Suncor. Got him. What? I ain't even using my tyrant powers yet, bro. So sad, so futile, so hopeless. Your time is running out, king of monsters. Despite your every effort, I am still standing tall and proud. I will never falter in the face of evil. Never. Open your eyes, Ed, and watch very carefully. Watch as your legacy burns in my way. This will be my victory. What, did you th what do you think you're doing, Ed? We gave you our powers exactly for this moment. The fire to scorch any foe, the wings to overcome all hardships, the breath to soothe all evil, the spark to inspire all allies. You have it all, Ed. Rise up. Rise up, king of monsters.
it's a box art. It's a box art legendary. Long, long ago, in a burning skyward battlefield, the foretold king of monsters was reborn. On the day of reckoning, Ed walked towards a face of extinction to forge the future of our world. This is the story of the invincible tyrant of light. Listen to my oath, Ed. As long as I draw breath, you will never walk on the planet below again. By my own two hands, you will never walk amongst humans again. Bear witness to my final stand, King of Monsters. Bear witness to the end of your brethren. Bear witness to a brighter tomorrow. Nice. Solus. Deal psychic type damage with a 30% chance to inflict provoked. Uh, prevents this next mon from a. Okay. Uh, deals massive psychic type damage. Deals psychic type damage with a. Cr okay, massive. Let's go. Jesus. Oh, come on. Seriously? This isn't even fair. <laughs> Holy crap. Why am I only level 68? Gosh. Wait, I gained XP? I beat you up. This lad, he is strong. He will do just fine, yes. What's the matter, boy? It's the same. It's the same all over again. I slayed Omnicron and then ruined this kid's world. Now he will slay Vados and then what? Hmm. Here's what I think, lad. You made a terrible mistake indeed. But you were only human. journey's end. Oh, I love it. Hmm, you're so close to the end, or are you? Do you regret how things have turned so far? It's never too late to go back. Do you wish to return to the capital city? This will reset your progress before entering the airship. No. So, you are the famous head. No. You do not know me, or perhaps you did in another lifetime. Here, let me tend to your next mom party. This is the least I can do for you. I wish I could help more than that, but my days of adventuring are long gone. It's your turn now, Ed. Ed, my friend. You're asking about this island. Well, I haven't got the Phaeton's idea. Haha. -ha. What is this place? Whatever. What, what matters now is that Vados isn't here. Defeat him and nothing will stand in your path as a king of monsters. You'll finally bring balance to the world, both for humans and Nexamon. So, you are Ed, yes? Pay me no mind, but I'm a spectator here to see the conclusion of what I once started. Don't be too hard on Amelia and the guild, Ed. It was Omnicron who pushed them to such extreme measures. But you can set things right. You can be the one in charge of this world. Or you can be the one, sorry, you can be the change this world needs. Onwards, child. So, I'm kind of curious, and again, I haven't played Nexamon 1, but... Nexomon 1 is actually a sequel to a game called Micromon or something, so I wonder if any of these are like Micromon people. I know she's apparently a Nexomon 1. Are these all just Nexomon 1 people? I don't know. <sighs> anyway. It's Edward. Hmm, Ed. In all the time I've known you, you've served mankind well, so I shall give you the benefit of the doubt, King of Monsters. I won't stand in the way this time. But I know, but no, this child. You do not know what battles truly is capable of. What lies ahead is a battle that you cannot win.
The Nexomon sought to wipe out all of mankind millennia ago. They carry the will of Omnicron, the merciless king who twice brought ruin upon our planet. And now, long after his downfall, his malevolent offspring continue to tear this world asunder. Is it... Is the righteous thing to not vanquish such evil? Look at me, Ed, and tell me that I'm wrong. I'm not the product of villainy. I'm the product of desperation. I'm humanity's sad cry for help. Can you not hear them? You were meant to be the best of us, Ed. On that day at the orphanage, I could see the resolve and kindness in your eyes. It gave me hope for our future. Mere lies. It was all a puny veil of deception. You are not human, Ed. You are a monster. A monster cannot lead mankind to anything but ruin. So listen well, you cowardly creature. I am Amelia, the 47th head of the Tamer's Guild of Parham. And on this day, I shall slay the monster before me. Pfft. I slayed your predecessor. You don't think I'll slay you too, bitch? New Sedile. Let's go. EMP. 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 What you got? Twin Electrode. What you got? What you got? Fella Blanca. Oh, you're just gonna use a bunch of starters, aren't you? <laughs> can only carry six, though. You don't even have all of them. Hmm. <laughs> Let's go for the Ice Assault, see if we can't get a freeze. He's probably gonna die anyway. Like, let's be real. Domigator likes to die, it's thing. Yeah, maybe not. Ice Assault? Trying to come at me with a normal type girl. What is this? Arcane Magic. Not as much damage as I'd like to see. Eh. He's more of a tank, but it is what it is. Um, let's bring out the bull take. He's fast. Oh, he switched. Oh, that's even better. Thunder. Are you gonna kick me? I'm honestly not sure if this will kill. Ooh, it didn't. I didn't think so. Okay, the next one will though. Goodbye. Okay, this will kill. You ain't resistant. Dracon. Oh, you have... Wait, you have the dragons? What are you doing with the dragons? You're not supposed to have the dragons. I'm not super worried about it. You have a dragon, I have a dino. Oh, and a Hanok. Okay. Well, let's see how Hanok likes Repto Motor. Because I, I, I don't know if you know if you know this, but uh, Repto Motor is kind of a beast. Kind of low on stamina, though. I'd be careful about that. Eh, let's drain him. Might be useful. Might be useful to get a little stamina up in here. Switch to the tray. To the tray. To the tray. To the tray. To the sword. Meteor attack of death. <sighs> Can't believe this is it, guys. We're gonna. We're gonna rip. Did it kill itself? Are you serious? What the heck was that? Pathetic. He even had a dragon. Even had a dragon. You couldn't take me out. Come on. Can I throw him in the lava now? Oh, Amelie. Until the very end, you stood by my side. Such is the sweet humanity that I yearn to save. This long and painful struggle must end. Do it, Vados. Smite it all. Scorch the skies above and shatter this very mountain. The absolute obliteration of Ed. Nothing else matters. There can be no future with Ed. None. 
disappear now, Ed. Slumber forever in the dark pages of history. He mega evolved. Heed my words, Ed. Heed my words, King of Monsters. On this very day, we will decide the fate of our world. Humans, Nexomon, only one will prosper. And the other will become dust and be fed to the wind. I, I can't believe my eyes. D did Vados just evolve? Such raw power. Such absolute wickedness. The end of time, the end of times is upon us. Uh, Amelie, this is beyond our control. Can't you feel it? We must retreat now. This fight is not worth it. Shut up, Edward. So this is the beginning, if you guys haven't caught up to that by now. Our people shall rise as Ed falls. Annihilate him, Vados. Do not hold back. Hmm. Ha 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 ha. Don't be sad, Ed. This is but an act of providence. Embrace it fully, King of Monsters. Perish with a smile. I'm gonna perish with your mama. I'm, a, I'm not gonna lie. A little bit scared. Wait, actually? No way. No way. He's not this weak. There's no way. This has to be... This ha No, I don't believe it. I don't believe this at all. Yeah, okay, that makes more sense. Hey, that's not fair. Vados is restoring his own health. It doesn't matter. We'll simply crush him over and over again. Do not falter, my liege. Vados can't do this forever. I like those little uh, pop-in things. They should have done that more through the story. Water blast. That would have been cool if they had more like of those uh, pop-in texts. He's been using a rock-type attack, but, you know, gotta go with the fireball. Let's see if we can't poison him. I'm not poisoning him. You guys know what I mean. Mm. What you gonna do against the thick boy, though? You cannot slay me, King of Monsters. Feel the despair of humanity had to live with for a millennia. Like, it'd be cool if some of the trainers you fought, like, like the, not, not all of them, but, like, some of the main ones had, like, those little dialogue boxes. I don't know. Nexomon 3 ideas. And however this game ends, if it's not open-ended, and it can't have a third one, then Nexomon 0. Or something. We need more Nexomon, man. Oh, you went first. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, Reptile motor, I'm pretty sure it's faster. Such laughable power, Ed. Perhaps you were never meant to be a king. Nothing but a hollow title. Who are you taunting, bro? I didn't expect to survive. Uh, Domigator at least resists the attack. 10% chance for freeze. It'd be nice if we can get a freeze. Oh. Oh, never mind. I thought, I thought that was going to get me. I haven't been paying attention, but is his stamina restoring each time he heals? It is. You fucker. Oh well. <laughs> no matter how many times we strike him down, Vados keeps regenerating. There has to be a way to end him for good. We need more firepower. We need... Do the transformation thing. Come on, it's obvious. The only thing that might work against Vados. You must become a tyrant of light again, Ed. No, no pressure.
Hmm. Ah, yes, there it is, finally. At long last, your true form surfaces before me. You saw my true form like five seconds ago. I will, I will enjoy destroying it, your true self, your very essence. Come and try it. Try as many times as you wish. Can I, can I also use my next someone? I don't know what he did, but it scares me. Wait, am I allowed to use items? I don't think I can win this without items. Oh my god, I'm not allowed to use items. I can't win this, there's no way. Unless the game expects me to uh, grind the Tyrant of Light, how am I supposed to win this? Okay, I'm supposed to lose. His power, it simply is too much. There's no way, we just can't win this fight. M my lead, you must retreat to safety. I will stay here and buy you time and ensure your survival. Ha 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 ha. Yes, Ed, listen to your moronic vassals. Flee while you can. Your pathetic true form can no longer harm me, the shield of mankind. Evil can never prevail as long as I draw breath. Parham will rejoice as you perish. 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 My king, Ed. It is us, the tyrants who faithfully serve you. Oh yeah, I forgot about these guys. You have given us a second chance. Now, we have come to aid you in your darkest hour. Nivalis will have your back. Mulsimor will be your sword. Eurus will be your wings. Bolzin shall be your eyes. Petram ought to be your shield. And Tikala will hold your spirit. This is it, Ed. The time has come. Your ascension. Oh, it's so epic, bro. This is sick. Oh, shit. Behold, Vados. Look at me, I leveled up. I evolved. This is the purest form of our kind. The supreme Nexomon stand before you. Long live the king of monsters. Long live Ed. I mega evolved, bro. I want Super Saiyan. Ha. Ha ha. Ha 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 ha. Oh, Ed. Ed. Your dearest tyrants are but a nuisance, a feeble incon inconvenience in my mission to lay waste to your kind. But my, my, I can't deny their allegiance, such brilliant devotion towards their king. But what sort of king are you? We shall find out. Ed, you must focus. This is our only chance to destroy Vados. You have other tyrants to use at your disposal. Use them wisely. Oh, so I guess I don't get to use Tikala? That's okay. Okay, he's a ghost type, but he has a rock type move, so I have to be careful. So let's go with water. This is what I'm looking for. 1500 HP? Buddy. Ooh, you've got to be kidding. Battles is altering the terrain. His own element has changed. Turning the battlefield into his advantage, huh? I mean, you turned into a water type and I'm still a water type. So, I mean, it's not that great of a thing for me, but it's also not the worst thing in the world. I'm not too worried about it. This actually makes sense. But remember when we were looking through the, uh, for those of you who have seen it, uh, we were looking through the Nexomon uh, decks, or the Nexopedia, Nexopedia uh, before the game came out. I noticed that there was no Psychic or Ghost-type Tyrants. Well, that's why, because the Tyrant of Light is a Psychic-type, and Battles is a Ghost-type by, by uh, thing. Yeah, yeah, you're going to beat me, buddy? You're going to beat me? You're going to beat me, bro?
Cyclone. Cyclone. I mean, I'm still good against you, so... Probably wasn't the best move on your part, dude. Wind on wind? All I have is wind type attacks. Okay, let's go bulls in again. EMP is just such a solid attack. Just eat this. Boom. Probably gonna switch up now. Yep. He's an electric type. Ah, oh, do you have no shame, Ed? Do you feel no remorse for what your kind has done? You appall me, sicken me. There will be no mercy for you. Well, if only I had my Tracer. Love to you. Oh, he has Meteor Shower. It's all good, man. I don't even have to use my actual form. Oh, I do. <laughs> you, you will condemn us all. You despicable king. Urgh. Well, I mean, if you're gonna give me uh, a regular form, might as well use it. Ooh. I mean, I kind of want to land the deciding blow, but he ain't gonna let me. So if he's gonna use a ghost type attack, I'm gonna switch to, to the water type. Oh my god, he one shot at it. Tall Storm. Did zero? Are you serious? Oh, I think I, I think I have to kill him as a uh, Omnison. Omnison. Sorry, Omnison. I think I have to kill him as Omnison. Okay, so what we're gonna do then is we're gonna heal. Because that makes the most sense. I think everything, yeah, everything's just gonna one shot now. Change the rules on me. I never even really used Malsimer. It's too bad. All I got for killing him was 1100 XP. Humans and Nexomon, they can never coexist. They will wage war after war. They will devour each other to him for a millennia to come. And that will be your legacy. Nexomon 3, let's go. Oh, we straight up murdered this guy. It's over. It's finally over. My liege, you are victorious, the supreme Nexomon. Long live Ed, eternal ruler of Nexomon. Is there not another way? It's the same, it's all the same. Absolutely not. You cannot compare Vados to Omnicron. Vados was a malevolent creature who only sought to bring us ruin. That sounds exactly like Omnicron. Nothing but a miserable puppet, a mindless m macabre? Macabre? I don't know how to say that. And soulless tyrant. His only purpose in this world was to serve as a warning to anyone who opposes Ed. That's all. I agree. There was nothing we could do. Tragic. His heart was in the right place, but the poor creature was blinded by Amelie's delusions. We should leave now. This story is over. Are we gonna bring him back to life? I felt bad for him. Yes. Huh? What are you doing, Ed? I actually felt bad for the guy. 
What, what, what are you doing, Ed? He's reviving Vados. What, why? Why are you doing this, my liege? This is not a creature you can argue with. Ed. There is no convincing this monster. Any act of mercy will be wasted on him. I beg you to stop. Wait a second. I think I get it. Ed is planning to... And you guys thought I was the dumb one? <laughs> no. Ed, of all the things that you could have done, why this? Ed has chained his life force to yours, Vados. Your fates are now one and the same. You tried to enslave me, like, he, like you have done to the other tyrants. The tyrants became loyal to Ed after the resurrection, so perhaps the same can work on Vados? Foolish king, your magic does not work on me. I do not bow to you and I never will. My allegiance has not changed and I never will. Your mercy is in vain. I belong to humanity alone, and that remains my mission, same as always. And that's the desire of your king, isn't it obvious? You and Ed both yearn for the same peace, that's why nothing's changed inside that thick skull of yours. You blurt nonsense, a wretched deception. I... I don't. I can't. It's fine, Vados. Do as Ed says. Are you siding with Ed now, Amelia? You of all people? I don't care if you created me, I will defy you if I must. Hmm. Defy me, huh? You dare harm me, Vados? I will spare you no sympathies. Anything that threatens Parham will be dealt with that, I swear. Then it's settled. I engineered you specifically to obey me, Vados, and here you are, threatening to crush me. I'm no longer your master. Someone else took ownership of your soul. So whatever is going inside your heart, it is the work of Ed himself, your new king. No. No. I No, I can't. What have you done to me, Ed? Answer me. The same thing he's been doing to all the other tyrants, a second chance. Welcome aboard, Vados. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Nobody's saying anything. Rawr. Great job, guys. What could possibly go wrong about giving Vados, giving Vados a nervous breakdown? Give him time. His, enti his entire world has been turned upside down. We will come to He will come to his senses, then you'll have an invaluable ally. You ought to pay for your mon monumental idiocy, Amelie. Your crimes against my king will not be overlooked. Exile awaits you. Exile me if you must. I don't regret anything, fool. I have lost the power to stop Ed. This world is now at his mercy, for better or for worse. Wait, wait. Can you promote me before you get exiled? I can't believe that you're still a bronze tamer. <laughs> now you've done it, Ed. At long last, our world will be in good hands. Thank you, King of Monsters. And thank you, too. What? Why are you all staring at me? Speak up. Can we do it now, the thing? Yeah, whatever. Let the credits roll. He had to teleport away so I can catch him later. Oh, man. This game, this game was incredibly good. Like, I, I words cannot express how good this game is. Like, oh my god. Sure, it had its its little uh, at the beginning. It felt like they were pushing the uh, third wall breaks a little too much. But man, like the game has everything. It has like interesting characters. It has like, like even okay even the throwbacks to the old characters feel nice like like how the uh, protagonist from uh, Nexamon ones there and when you beat him like midway through the game you don't actually beat him you you're you're uh, you're beating him when he's not really trying that much like stuff like that they they had respect for the old character I really like this game holy crap I'm sad to see, I'm sad to have beaten it. I'm still going to be doing guides. Like like we still got to do a mega rare guide, a vault location guide. We, we still got a lot to do, but oh man. We need they're going to come out with a hardcore mode and they're going to come out with some other stuff and I know they're planning like some sort of DLC. Um There oh, this is so good. Let's see if I can skip the credits. Or is it just gonna show? It's gonna force me, isn't it? Why? why I, I, that's one thing I don't understand. Why do games force you to watch all the credits? Like, come on now. 
I'll, uh, I'll throw a cut here. Uh, or I'll speed it up so that you guys don't have to sit through the entire credits, so... Bear with me here. And we're back. Yeah, I just sped that up. I didn't think you guys would want to sit there. I didn't have really anything else to say other than this game is awesome. Many centuries later. Oh, shit. Unknown location. Guess all my friends are dead. And that's the story of our King Ed. That's how he made this. That's how he made his greatest ally, Va Vados. Together, they forged a bright future, and we—the bright future we enjoy to this day. Any questions? What happened to the cat? I don't know. Nobody really asks about Coco or whatever his name is. Is it true that Ed dropped his first client in a hole? What? what? I don't even. Where did you hear that anyway? I even heard that he tried to run away and change his name. All right, that's enough. Ed would never do something like that. I think. I can't believe that Vados used to be evil. He's the coolest Nexomon ever after King Ed, of course. We live in an era of unprecedented peace thanks to both of them, but it cannot last forever. That's why we must train a new generation of tra tamers to protect the legacy of our king. Really? But we're not that good. Aha, don't you worry, kids. There is a saying passed down from generation to generation. If you wish to become the strongest tamer, simply find and ask a shooting star. Thank you for playing our game, Ed. We hope to see you again in the sequel. <gasps> what? They actually straight up confirmed it? Coco? <laughs> Once upon a time, our planet was torn asunder in a war between humans and Nexamon. But right on the brink of extinction, the king of monsters was reborn to challenge the wheel of fate and to save our future. Upon your ascension, our world has finally begun to heal. This is the realm that you have fought for. This is the fruit of all your countless adventures. Welcome to the new world of Nexima. This is your legacy. Seriously? Oh my god. So this is it. Like, Nexomon's gonna be like a franchise. Like, like okay, so... Oh, this is so sick. So I I'm imagining, like, like, because, okay, the world doesn't have to be in disarray in every Nexomon title. If you look at a game like uh, Pokemon, for example... Uh, the, the, the world's not generally in disarray. Like, sure, there's a stupid evil team trying to do something, whatever, but you don't necessarily... You don't even necessarily need that in a story. Like, you, you, you could just have a story about someone's own personal growth, dealing with their own personal enemies and stuff like that. Like, the fact that Pokemon has evil teams that are trying to destroy the world isn't necessarily something needed, because if they do come out with an Exomon 3, there, there better be a good reason why Vados and, and the King aren't, aren't doing something about it, right? But if you have a... If you have Nexomon games that are more about, like, personal growth and more akin to, like, Pokemon where, you know, maybe they, they battle Nexomon for, like, uh, for, for, for sport, basically, you can have interesting characters and, you know, quote-unquote villains that are maybe more on the petty side, like, they're not about to destroy the world, but they are doing some, like, stupid shit that the King w or Vados wouldn't have time to deal with because they're more busy with, like, the bigger problems. So, I'm actually super hyped, like, dude... I really hope Nexomon becomes a, uh, a staple franchise. Welcome back, Ed. Quite the bold move you performed, or so I'm told. Getting Vados on your side? Now that's remarkable. Where is Vados right now? I don't know. Uh, I don't know his whereabouts right now, but Vados is a logical creature. The two of you will surely become great allies. I wouldn't worry about him. I would definitely worry about him. <laughs> Amelia has been missing since that day, so I will... So I will be the guild leader uh, in term. 
Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a lot of paperwork to do in order to pardon these renegades as you kindly requested. See you later, Grandmaster Ed, or rather, should I say, King of Monsters. <laughs> you should probably keep an eye on that little... You should probably keep that little secret to ourselves for a while, though. Ed, Ed, it's time we get back to work, Ed. What? Don't give me that face. If your goal is to restore the world, what better way than doing quests? You're a guild tamer after all. And if you guys... And if you see Amelia during your travels, don't be too hard on her. Her work was truly for the good of the city. Am I the only one... Am I the only one concerned about that crazy woman being missing? We gotta find her. Okay, so th th this is where we're at right now. Tutorial. Congratulations on completing the main story, Ed. But your adventure is far from over. Many side quests are now available to let you capture all the legendary next month. A good place to start is by speaking with those characters in this building. Good luck, King of Monsters. Hint, Solus, that's you, has been added to your party. Oh, really? Let's see. Wait, who did it take out? Where's my Repto Motor? Wait, so when I use Solus, do I transform into it? Not important right now. Okay, so... This is where we're at. We're at the finale. This is about an hour and a half long episode, almost, give or take. What do you guys want from here? Do you guys want me to continue doing side quests as a Let's Play? I will do guides like how to get the legendaries and stuff like that, but let me know if you want to actually see me do side quests. Uh, let me know if you want the uh, the thing to continue. Uh, for example, in my Temtem Let's Play, I believe we finished the original uh, like story. This is before Kisiwa. At like episode 26, but we ended up getting to episode 30 just with uh, side quests and stuff. So let me know if you guys want me to continue doing this because I'm totally down. So let me know in the comments uh, for those of you who are still watching. Uh, if you did enjoy the video, make sure to like and subscribe. I can't believe we finally finished the story. It's been a while, but it is what it is. Uh, check out our subscriber discord. Follow me on Twitter, Gym Leader Ed. And until next time, peace.